in three, two, one, go! Round one comes to a close here in match number four. This is Alliance number three in red versus Alliance number six in blue here in the upper bracket of round one. Robots coming back from the Coral Stations here for the last second scores in the autonomous period of play. Blue Alliance securing six Coral up high versus the Red Alliance five. And Blue Alliance will take the early lead, 58 to 48. The 10 point lead goes to Alliance number six. Two LG up in the air, Link waiting their turn over on the blue side of the field, throwing that one up, and that has a little bit too much speed as it pops over the other side into red territory. It is all LG here early, 3970, getting the quarrel started for the Red Alliance. Similar story over on blue. The Blue Machine 4907 Thunder Stamps out of St. Thomas, Ontario, beginning to fill up this reef for the Blue Alliance. Now they're going to be joined by their teammates with LG taken care of, and they are filling up level four fast. They keep the lead 108 to 100 with just over a minute and a half left in play. 17 Coral here scored by the Blue Alliance. 30-45, starting it here for the Red Alliance, the Gear Gremlins, working on level number four. Their teammates going down low, level number three for the Red Alliance. A minute 11 left in play. Blue Alliance has a slight advantage, 148 to 142. It is close here in match number four of the playoffs. Team 3970 reducing that cycle time using the ground intake right by that reef. They have plenty of coral along the ground to take care of. They have plenty to choose from. Their human players able to get it all the way out towards that reef zone, significantly cutting down the amount of time it takes to get back to the reef in time. Currently operating with two robots here is 4728, still static and motionless by that Red Alliance Reef. Their drive team trying to figure out exactly what's going on with that machine. They have 34 seconds left to get back into this one. 192 to 180, Red Alliance trailing, trying to close the gap here in the final 25 seconds of play. Blue Alliance looking for some last second cycles here on that reef. It is filling up all three top levels of the reef filled up by the Blue Alliance. They can only work here on the trough, level one. Each one of those worth two points apiece. They decide to break off for the barge here with the deep cages hanging from above. Five seconds left to go. It's three, two, one. Close climbs on both sides of the field. Looks like it could be two. Go to the Blue Alliance. Alliance number six takes it. 232 to 212. And Alliance number six takes the final spot here in the upper bracket. Alliance number three, we'll see them again next round in match number six.